I have a little bit of news on why WWE are throwing together so many multi-person matches. We're seeing this tonight on Raw. We've got another eight-man tag, another six-woman tag. We had a ten-man tag on SmackDown. It's all getting a bit silly. It's all just getting that little bit silly. The reason they're doing this is because they are worried about losing out on time. They are at the moment trying to do exactly what they did last year, which is when they essentially put a mandate forward to have longer matches and try and keep people engaged for longer. This is why we're seeing 40 minute matches. They want the matches to go for longer. This is a very positive thing and means that we as an audience should be more entertained, but it's difficult to immediately be able to say that it's more entertaining to have longer matches. They also believe this is better for sponsors because viewership is expected to be lower right now. So if they have matches, they keep viewership through commercial breaks. Because they want longer matches, they don't have time to work as many feuds as they used to. So what they're doing with feuds is squashing them all together into multi-person matches. Also, with no shakeup happening right now, the hope with the multi-person matches is that they're able to get people physical and keep the storylines going without it getting boring and without overplaying their hand. Thank you very much for the host, Jay Quick. Welcome to the show. Very happy to see you. When it comes to the 10-man tag, there was a number of different storylines involved in that. We saw Sami Zayn and Apollo Crews have a moment with the Intercontinental Championship. Kevin Owens was still involved in that. Otis and Gable were looked at as a threat. And Baron Corbin began a rebuild, which will be integral to him going forwards. He's going to have some big moments in SmackDown in the next few months. And I think he's also a potential contender for the uh, Money in the Bank as well. This is one of the reasons they're throwing all of this together. And essentially, it's a, it's a favour of somewhere like New Japan. It's a way of getting people together and fighting without necessarily have, having them actually coming to any sort of conclusive finish. It's supposed to wet your whistle, basically, and that's why they are doing this.